hello everyone welcome back the today video is about to see the phone number with their countries into the database so you can see do these countries in your any type of application so i'm doing this uh, with the laravel so let's start it so this question asked 11 years ago and uh, someone answered this in the json format right so now we are going to insert these countries into our database so let's go to the laravel project and here you need to create uh, first seeder and then we will seed these countries into our database so let's uh, create uh, first let me create a model and uh, a table right so it's a uh, php artisan make model and uh, the model name is country okay and uh, i want to also create a migration so i am adding a uh, migration flag here so model is created yes this one okay and let's go to the database and do uh, and, and, and and yes this is also going to create in a few seconds so let's wait for a moment to complete this process and yes it's completed successfully so now we need to migrate this table into our database artisan migrate okay so it will migrate the last table okay yes it's migrated so let's go to the database and check that is it migrated or not so give it a refresh and uh, yes this table is migrated here right so oh i forgot to add a, a column here so let me roll back this last migration so php artisan migrate and roll back so if you don't familiar with this uh, roll back a specific migration so can you can watch my previous videos where i explain that how you we can roll back a specific migration so, so i'm also creating this uh, string because uh, um, some country codes having uh, some symbols like plus and stuff like that I'm making this code right save this one and now let's migrate this pp artisan migrate hit enter and yes it's migrated so let's clear it and now we need to create a country seeder so let's create a seeder php artisan make uh, make seeder and the seeder name would be the country seeder okay hit enter and it will create seeder for us yes let's go to the database uh not seeder uh, yes seeder and there is a country seeder right so here we need to uh, execute our uh, array file right so first i want to truncate uh, the uh, table for uh, let me make this table and the, our table name is countries countries okay let me finally type this countries and I want to truncate it right so if there is any entries it will first uh, remove the entries and then recreate uh, recreate uh, from this line okay so let's go here and uh, you need to copy this all of the stuff but this is in the json format so we need this in the array format so i converted this into an array here right so you can grab this uh, file from there file entries not file so you can also uh, get this file from the uh, from using a, a story get method so you can get this file and uh, you can get the file content so i'm copying this uh, from this file this is a, uh, this is in array format so i will add this uh, in the description so you can also get this file and see the, the countries into your database so it's very simple oops okay let's copy this go to the uh, cedar file and here you need to create a variable of uh, countries oops um, okay and then to go to the next line and here you need to paste this all of the stuff okay and then this is an array so you need to uh, save this array so in our case it's a model name is country oops country and uh, then you need to make this insert because we are inserting multiple records so insert will uh, add multiple used to add multiple record into the database so create will not work for this situation right 
so this will insert the data into the database so now for now our database is empty right so let me give it a refresh and yes name and code is there so here we need to run our seeder so the command is php artisan db seed db seed and then you need to call your seeder so class our class name is this one right so it's a country seeder and hit enter and yes it says database seeding completed successfully so let's hit refresh and yes it's uh, seeded the name and their code into the database so you can uh, search their name so i'm searching my country code and uh, this name so my country is pakistan and yes pakistan country code is this one so it's uh, exactly what uh, we are looking for so i'm for i get this json from there and uh, i converted this into an array format and uh, then i'm i follow this blog it's very uh, very clear right so first you need to uh, create your project then you need to create a migration right and then you can create a seeder here and i did not use this because uh, in our case i'm using the country code not this country uh, country code like uh, in this string format so that's why because i want to send a sms uh, to uh, each number so that's why i use this uh, code here so other, otherwise i will use this uh, array right so then how you can get this you can get this i'm not i'm doing this in the uh, cdl so you can do this in your controller so here you can use pluck method and get only name and the code from the database so that is the beauty of this pluck method so hopefully you under, uh, understood the concept so if you are interested to learn more about laravel subscribe the youtube channel and stay connected bye, -bye.